you know that that New York is a place that's more about people becoming these political bosses and controlling black people than it is about truly empowering anybody. And, I, and I'm just going to tell you, as a person who sat next to some of the most prominent people out here, the only people that are really going to care about your liberation is going to have to be you. The only people that really care about your family is you. So the theme for this year's All Black National Convention is very basic. It is that black leadership starts in the home. Black leadership starts in the home. You are the black leader that you've been waiting for. You are your own Superman. You are your own Superwoman. And, and while that might put a lot of pressure on you, that might make you a little nervous. It might make you feel like, oh, gosh, I don't know if I can do this. But I'm here to tell you that you can. And so when you're looking for your black leader, and I'll be happy to be a guide. I can be one of your advisors, right? And I'm honored to have that role. And I, I'm going to do my best in that capacity. And I'll share with you what I know. But I'm telling you, I really believe that that the only group that's really going to have your family self-interest at heart to the core is going to be you. So look in that mirror and find that black leader you're looking for. Don't fall the old for the old ancient Negro tradition of looking for a Jesus or somebody to worship. Like I remember when Obama ran for office and there were people that were on their knees, literally bowing to him like he was a god or something. And I'm like, these politicians, they have a thousand things to think about other than you. This is not the guy that's going to make your life better. It is you, you, you. Absolutely, Miss Khabibi, it's you, you, you. So that's good news to me. That means, okay, so this is in my control. So now that means I have to have the responsibility to uh, make the choices that are going to help me get there. So again, start with those three areas, health, wealth, and relationships. What does that look like? What does it mean to be physically and mentally healthy? What does it mean to be wealthy and financially secure? And what does it mean to have good relationships as opposed to bad ones? A, a mentally and physically healthy person with good relationships who is financially secure is, is, a, is a very strong and empowered black person. Doesn't matter what race you are. If you're in those three categories, you can navigate this world any way that you want. You just got to stop listening to crazy people because <laughs> the world's full of them. Who knows? Sometimes I might be one of them because I'm in the same world y'all live in. Ain't, no, ain't none of us perfect in this game. All right. So I'm going to go. I got my Chinese food here. So I'm about to go eat. And uh, and if you're coming to L.A. for the Stock Options Summit, I look forward to seeing you there. Uh, if you still want to learn options or if you want to be a part of our prime program, which a lot of students love, some of you are in here now. Uh, if you love it, please say that you love it so other people will know that I'm not just making things up. Uh, and it, we're proud of it because, you know, we're trying to grow the Black Business School by giving you extraordinary training that's at a very high level, something you can't get anywhere else. Uh, and so uh, if you want to actually take a look at the prime program, there's a free training you can take a look at called How to Make Money Without Working. So to get access to that, just pull out your phone, text the word money to eight. 87948 text money to 87948 and you will get um you will get uh, a link to watch the training and uh Josette says stop supporting Chinese food uh well you know what I'm sorry I wanted some General Zoe's chicken so so I, I I told you I ain't perfect so whatever all right so anyway I'm out of here guys have a good night and I'll see y'all um tomorrow well actually tomorrow morning I can't do financial consciousness training but I will be back the day after tomorrow. So thank you all for hanging out with me. I appreciate you 100% and God bless you. Um, and by the way, Dr. Claude Anderson books, if you want to go support him, again, if you've got some extra resources, you want to go just make it rain on his website. His family would really appreciate it. Uh, health, he's older. So, you know, it's harder to make money when you get older. And so if you have it in your heart or have the ability to support, um, I hope you'll go to powernomics.com and, uh, and, and and put a little money in their pocket. Uh, they deserve it. They really deserve our support. So uh, and then also my website is drboycebooks.com. My wife's books there are, are there on things like financial anxiety, how to cope with that. Uh, I've got we got a new apparel section. You can get some uh, really cool blackish uh, shirts if you want. And then also we have stuff for your kids. And uh, so just go there. And, and so anything on, on Black Wealth Mastery is there. And that's drboycebooks.com. So have a good night, everybody. I'll see you soon. Take care.